Hello everybody and welcome to this tutorial on how to make blue flames in Adobe After Effects. Here is what we are going to be creating. This effect is inspired by the TV series Heroes, where this one guy, uh, Flint Gordon, is uh, creating blue flames. And now we are going to do it in After Effects. First of all, I'm going to drag this footage down to a new composition. Then I'm going to drag this fire footage down. And this can be downloaded from uh, Detonation Films. Uh, then I'm going to hit F4 and uh, change the transfer mode to add. Then I'm going to find this one spot where it's burning uh, really long. Here. Then I'm going to hit S and scale it, scale it up. Then I'm going to hit P for position and set the keyframe. Then I'm going to keyframe the flame position so that it follows my hand the entire time. You can also keyframe your hand, but, but since uh, this is only a tutorial, uh, this is easiest. Oops. Like so. There. Okay, now we are going to make the flames blue. So we type in the effects and presets, we type CC toner. Then we are going to drag it to the flames. For the highlights, set it to a blue color, which is very bright, a light blue color, and for mid tones, set it to a dark blue color. Just play around with the settings until you are satisfied. Okay, now we are going to add a glow. So type glow in the effects and presets section. Drag the glow to the um, flames and bring down the intensity and uh, Adjust the radius until you are satisfied. Like so. Okay, now we are going to make a glow on the hand to make it a bit more realistic. Go to the layer, new, solid, make it a bit uh, light blue, make it comp size and choose OK. Set the transfer mode to add, and then just uh, draw a rough mask around the hand. Just going to make it cover my entire hand almost. Like so. There. Then I'm going to parent it to the flames so that it will follow my hand, the flame, in the entire time. Then I'm going to hit F to bring up the feather and feather it. Like so. Then I'm going to hit T to bring the opacity and bring it down just a little bit. There. Now I'm going to hit M to bring up the mask path. Then I'm going to adjust the mask so that it's going to cover my hand 
the entire time. Let's see. Like so. A bit more. Looking good. Now, uh, to make it a bit more realistic, I'm going to um, change the colors on the footage. So I type in the effects and presets, day for night. This is a preset from the site videocopilot.net. I'm going to drag the day for night presets to the footage. Then I'm going to shut off the ramp and CC composite. In the curves, I'm going to adjust it just a little bit to make it a bit brighter. Uh, like so. And there we have it. A quick ramp preview. And you can see that you have created blue flames. Uh, my name is Didrik. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. and. Bye-bye.